What's going on ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another video. Today we have one of the drivers announced for DJR Crossley and it was announced earlier this afternoon, well later to the evening I should say. The driver that will be the first driver announced at DJR Crossley is Tanner Gray. Tanner Gray last year went from the NHRA where he won the championship last year and transitioned over to NASCAR development program for the DJR Crossley's development program I should say in 2019 where he was able in the can not the, well what it was called the can pro e series was able to score his first career win he ran a few select races in the gan outdoors truck series in 2019 the final three races at martinsville texas no martinsville ism and homestead he ran the final three races where in each of those three races he was able to score three top 20 finishes pretty impressive stuff from tanner gray and now it has been announced that Tanner Gray will run full-time in the NASCAR Gannard Doors Truck Series, along with running a few select ARCA races, ARCA East races, and I believe ARCA races at the same time, like the main like the main series as well. He'll be running the East, and he will be running the, the main. Here's what Tanner Gray had to say. I'm really looking forward to the next year, said Gray. Obviously, running full-time in the truck series is going to be tough, which how competitive the series is. It's going to be challenging racing with these guys week in and week out, but I have a lot of great people around me. The experience in the DJR Crossley guys will help me adapt and learn quickly. It's also exciting that Ford is coming on board and giving us assets that will further advance our performance each week. For those of you who are not caught up in the news, and I talked about this a couple days ago, for uh, DJR Crossley went and switched their manufacturer from the Toyota stable over to the Ford stable. So Ford will be have two teams, some one somewhat competitive uh, team that is joining Thorsport as the two main Ford teams at the in the trucks organization. And they prepared him earlier this year, like I said, in three races earlier in 2019. Here is what Todd Gillen had to say about Tanner Gray. Tanner has done a great job in his transition to stock car racing, says team, said team owner, co-owner co David Gillen. I was really impressed at how well he picked up the feel of the car and was able to provide very detailed feedback. It's a big step up to the truck series, but there's not a doubt in my mind that he's ready for it. I'm confident that the team was we are assembling at DGR is going to have one, one in as a factor every weekend and will compete for wins. I'm really looking forward to seeing what he can do. That's basically what David Gillen had to say. Now to give you my opinion on Tanner Gray coming over to the Truck Series full time. I'm kind of excited and intrigued about Tanner Gray. I've been kind of intrigued since he announced he was going to go from NHRA, which is way different than NASCAR, over to the NASCAR uh, ARCA Series. And he did really well in those series. I, I mean, in the ARCA Ace Championship, he did very well. You know, he picked up his first ever um, win in the ARCA Series. I think he just has a lot of potential. And I think he's got a lot to prove prove here in the truck series i mean yes he's not going to be running much he's not going to be running as good as some people think he is i think actually in my opinion i think he's going to do quite well i think he's going to surprise a lot of people and we have a very competitive truck series field he will also be competing for the rookie of the year honors and also be competing for a spot do i think he has a chance to win the rookie of the year that's very questionable because saint smith guys like saint smith and other drivers are going to be making their series full-time debuts. And other drivers to be announced. Because he's the first driver from the DGR Crossley that is going to be on joining the team. We have a driver that is supposed to be announced tomorrow when they go to the Ford Banquet. And announce it tomorrow at 12 o'clock. Uh, I think it's 12 o'clock Eastern. One o'clock. Uh, it's 1 o'clock Eastern, 12 o'clock Eastern. And it's 11 o'clock Central Time or 12 o'clock Central Time. There will be an announcement from DGR where they will announce their develop, other development driver that will be joining them in 2020. Many of people have linked Haley Deegan. That's why I made the video on Haley Deegan possibly going to Ford. Because of the fact that Haley Deegan might be that development driver announced, Adam Stern reported. So when Adam Stern reports something, you kind of have to kind of trust it because he's really good at insider facts. But here's my expectations for Tanner Gray. I think he will be one of the bigger focuses at DJ Crossley. I think... Depending on if Todd Gillen is going there, because there's a rumor that Todd Gillen also might be joining there, but they're going to be announcing their full lineup um, probably tomorrow as well, the rest of their lineup. I believe that Tanner Gray will do pretty well. I think he will finish in the top 10 in the truck standings. I think he will have an opportunity to make the playoffs in 2020. 
Do I think he scores a win? I don't know, but I think he's going to get a ton of top fives and a ton of top tens. I think Tanner Gray will surprise a lot of people, especially with how talented he is. Did really well in the NASCAR ARCA Series. And I think he's going to surprise a lot of people in 2020 in the NASCAR Gander Outdoors Truck Series. So, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Please like and subscribe to the channel. Turn notifications on to go notify when a video does go live on my channel. Follow me on all my social medias. Links in the description below that. And comment below your opinions on how you think Tanner Gray will do in 2020. Do you think he's going to struggle or do you think that he will succeed in 2020? Let me know below. Anyway, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care, everybody.